You might know me as Bacon Ninja, but I have a secret. I'm actually FPV Santa Claus. You see, I'm fat and jolly, I have a proclivity for milk and cookies, and I have a giant bag of FPV things that I am giving away because this is the 2023 Bacon's Season of Giving. Today's the first video in the Season of Giving, but there are several, and we're gonna give away all kinds of things from some of my favorite vendors. In fact, these vendors right here, who were kind enough to give a ton of products away to this series so that I could give them away to you because these vendors are some of the best top-notch vendors in FPV that really care about the community. And as soon as I told them that I wanted to give back for my channel's second birthday, they just threw products at me to give to you. I also told them that I'm going to internationally ship them. Yes, that's right. This is an international giveaway where local rules and regulations allow anyway. There are some bits of government red tape. But yes, I'm giving away a ton of things from those wonderful vendors to you internationally. No catch at all. Just make sure you're subscribed because there's going to be more than one of these and each one's going to have its own entry form. And I couldn't do this, I need to go ahead and mention, without the patrons, because they are helping me cover the immense expense of what it's gonna be to internationally ship all of these prizes. So thank you so much, patrons. It means the world to me, and it's gonna mean the world to the people that you helped get free FBV products to who win things. And for the first episode of the Season of Giving, I'm gonna start with the small things, but not really small. It's all tiny whoop stuff. So let's just dig right into it. We're gonna start with a bunch of products from Weebleed FPV. And the first one we're gonna start with is three sets of Weebleed FPV's Screamers 32,500 KV 0702 whoop motors. If you are into whoop racing, these are freaking killer. 0702s at that high KV, these things are going to rip your freaking face off. And I have three sets to give to you. They're wonderful red colored. I love the color they used on these motors. They are well built, solid, and if anybody believes in Tiny Whoop Racing, it's definitely Weebleed FPV. If you haven't seen their online based Weebleed FPV Whoop Racing series, you should definitely check it out. It usually starts qualifications in December. In fact, it was the first Whoop Racing series or racing series in general that I ever joined, and it was a freaking blast. You pay your entry money and you spend the next 10 weeks racing other people pretending these are in real life, but you can have a real life set, build your own racing whoop, and just tear the face off of some gates. And speaking of gates, they also sent over three sets of their pop-up tiny whoop racing gates. There are three pop-up gates in each one of these. There are three individual sets. That means three people will take these things home. And we have square, triangle, and circle. If you haven't ever raced whoops, getting a set of pop-up gates like this is a great idea. You just pop them up in the backyard and get to practicing. You don't have to worry about breaking your whoop. You can even fly them inside. I have used pop-up gates from Weebleed for a long time to practice in my house, and I really, really love them. They hold up really well, and you can get a whole lot of training done right in your living room. It's terrific, especially with the different shapes that they offer. It's always nice to mix it up a little bit. You don't always just want square ones. And they have three shapes to choose from in this particular model. They also sent over three rolls of their special made whoop gate tape. This is tape you would use to tape gates to things like doors and walls. It won't scratch your walls up. It's a silicone based, very, very sticky double sided tape. It's not the same thing that you would use for like double side taping of ETX into your quad. So you don't gotta worry about it ruining the paint on your home surfaces, but it is great for holding gates up and getting creative with it. So get creative with it. You probably can't tape up the pop-up gates, but you can definitely get creative. I have made some double gates out of pop-ups hanging from a wall using this product. So it is really, really good, highly recommend it. And each person who wins a set of pop-up gates will also win one of these. And just to really throw in the spice, there are koozies. Everybody who wins a Weebly product gets koozies. And maybe some people who don't win a Weebly product, because there are others coming in just a second, will get koozies too, because these are really cool koozies. You gotta love the Weebly FPV logo. I, I really, I've always loved that logo. So, awesome company. Thank you so much, Weebly, for sending all this stuff over. Six people are gonna have one heck of a time with the Weebleed products, but Weebleed isn't the only person who is in this video right now. There's more Tiny Whoop to come. Specifically, Tiny Whoop, because Tiny Whoop is also a huge sponsor of the Season of Giving. 
I just have to go ahead and shout out Tiny Whoop. I read a bunch of their product descriptions. If you've never been to their website to buy something, you should head over there and definitely check some things out. I recently purchased a Whoop from them. It was a great experience. They shipped it super fast. It, they didn't even know it was me who ordered it. It was terrific. They treated me like anybody else, and they did it super quickly and amazingly friendly. And their product descriptions are freaking hilarious. I, they, they really, you can tell they care about their products just because they take the time to make the descriptions so humorous so that you will just enjoy them when you're reading it, regardless of if you buy anything. But you should definitely check out their website. And to start it off, we have the Tiny Whoop Pinch Camera. This is a super duper small analog camera designed for the lightest of Tiny Whoops for racing. A lot of Tiny Whoops products are geared for racing and just doing fun things with whoops in general, but this camera is great for an all around experience for tiny whoops. It's super duper small. If I had to build a racing whoop, this would probably be the camera. I would probably go analog for the weight and this would be the one that I'd put on it. It's a great little cam. And not to stop there with the Whoop products, we have a set of their Cobalt Edition Onesies motors. These are a blue motor, which is a really good color. Again, red and blue, they're really hitting it with the colors. I am a fan of both. These are 0702s and a 26,000 KV, so a little bit lower KV than the Wee Bleed ones, but still enough to rip your face off. And the lower KV means that you can maybe run some steeper props. It all depends on your racing style. But these are amazing motors. They are true Tiny Whoop products, the original Tiny Whoop. The people who came up with Tiny Whoop made these. It's pretty awesome. So these are up for grabs too. And they also sent over a bunch of their LEDs. These are specialty made for Tiny Whoop use, meaning that they're all soldered to specialty made wire that is really light and durable so that you can actually use it on their quads. They have a whole bunch of different varieties. They have these that are their Tiny Drips, which is kind of an LED bar that's addressable. It is really pretty awesome. I have that in quite a few colors. They have this one, which is kind of like a flame candle light. I can think of some pretty cool uses. Then they have a whole bunch of these other ones. They're gonna be really hard to see on camera, but they are done on some really small magnetic wire and they are designed to go around the whoops of your tiny whoop and light up different areas. Then they gave me some of these, which are a longer version of that. And I had no idea what you do with them. These are called the whiskers. You should go look at the product page for the whiskers because what they are made for is hanging from your quad and it almost makes it look like a lit up jellyfish, which is super awesome. And since they're so light, they don't interfere with the quad. They have taken the time to design this product just so you can have fun. It is pretty awesome. They have a whole bunch of LEDs to choose from and I'll be giving these away in packs of two to people who win them. That way a few people can get them and I can mix and match the variety that you get so that you can have a little bit of extra fun too. This is called the face punch indicator. And it is exactly what it sounds like. It is a blinking LED that starts blinking whenever you hit something, or ideally punch somebody in the face with your quad. It is made to uh, just vibrate a small crystal in here and then start blinking. The things they come up with, man, they really love Tiny Whoop so much that they came up with a ton of use cases to have fun with them and made products to fit. And continuing on that theme, they also set a bunch of dress up stuff for your Tiny Whoops. I didn't even know this stuff existed. I immediately put this beanie on one of my small quads because I think it is the cutest freaking thing on top of a small Tiny Whoop. If it's winter time and you want to whoop, it can wear a beanie just like you. I've also got sunglasses. I've got a king's crown, a couple of those. I've got some mustaches and I've got a ton of angel wings. So if you want a quad dress up kit, that's up for grabs too. And if you want to do something even more fun and uh, maybe less responsible, but still plenty responsible, they sent me two packs of their micro streamers. These are for hanging from tiny whoops and having streamer fights. They are made specifically for tiny whoop size. They are specialty made really small so that you can hang them from a whoop and they won't get all in everything and mess it up. And it's just cool that they thought about how to do that with a tiny whoop. Nobody quite does it like tiny whoop when it comes to interesting stuff for tiny quads. They spend their whole life around that exact use case and they really love it so much that they made a bunch of products just so you can have fun. And everybody who wins LEDs will also get some of their small little LED work clothespins. These are clear acrylic clothespins that you can actually use to hold the LEDs on while you work on them because they are super duper small. And I'd recommend if you do win these, again, go to the product page for the item that you won because there's a lot of good advice on their page on how to install them successfully since they are such small components. They have a ton of advice and in if you're in doubt, just reach out to them. My experience talking to them has been terrific. They have been more than helpful, friendly and upfront. 
just like all the vendors in the season of giving, it's amazing to see vendors respond to a community outreach like this. They just sent me tons of their products. This is just episode one, and I'm not even done yet. There's going to be three episodes of this, and some of them have even more products than this from a bunch of different vendors that I had on that list in the front. So anyway, now that I'm done being sappy about all of this awesome outreach that the vendors are doing, let's move on to our last tiny Whoop vendor for episode one. And that would be Beta FPV, who sent over one of their Meteor 75 ELRS brushless whoops. This is a full whoop. It's still in the plastic. I'm not actually gonna show you any pictures of it because I'd hate to open it and take that experience away from whoever wins it, but it is brand new in the box and Beta FPV just sent it to me to give to you. And I'm gonna ship it anywhere in the world where it is legally possible to do so. So if you want a free whoop and a bunch of cool stuff, definitely sign up for this one. But that's not all they sent me. They sent me an entire Cetus X kit to give you. If you know somebody who's getting into FPV and you need to pick them up something with a controller and goggles and a quad, this is the perfect way to do it. Enter the giveaway and say you're interested in this. There will be options to select what you're interested in in the giveaway form. And it might be yours because this is the perfect thing to get somebody started. This is the Cetus version, not the Betaflight version. So it has a little bit more pilot assistance. It is great for someone just dipping their toes into the water of FPV. And it comes with everything they need to get started right out of the box completely bound. This is an expensive item. And Beta FPV is just giving it to you because they care so much about seeing you happy. I literally just asked all these vendors if they would like to participate in giving back to the FPV community via the season of giving. I threw an idea together. I put a timeline templates together. I said I was going to cover all the shipping with the patrons help. And they just shipped me this stuff. All of the vendors, all of these wonderful supporting vendors made this possible. And we're only through the first three right now. There's a whole lot more to come. So make sure you subscribe because there's gonna be two more of these where I give away a whole bunch more stuff. But there is a link to a form in the description below where you can go fill out what you're interested in and a bit of information about yourself so I know who I'd be sending it to and what you're interested in. And I'm gonna give all this stuff away at the end of the month. Be sure to read the top of the page on the form. It'll give you all the details about the giveaway and the timelines, things like that. It is open internationally. I don't wanna exclude anybody from being able to win this stuff. I think it's really important that as an FPV community, we work as a whole. Just because you live in another country that may be hard to ship to or expensive to ship to doesn't mean you shouldn't feel like part of the group. We all fly FPV. We are a small group of people worldwide and I wanna keep us as together as possible. So I'm including everybody in this. I'm gonna foot that bill. The patrons are gonna help me out and we're gonna get it there. I'm really excited to do this every year. This is just 2023 season of giving. But like I said, make sure to subscribe. There will be two more of these. Definitely share it with your friends. They can get in on the entries too. They don't even have to be FPV pilots. Just share the video and tell them to fill out the form. Thank you so much. I am. Absolutely looking forward to seeing how this is and how many people sign up and how many things I can give away to how many people in how many different countries. I am super excited for that. And then when we get done with all of it, I will go over those results in a video, even though everybody who won will already know, just so you know how many different countries we wound up sending things to. I think it's pretty interesting and a whole lot of fun. Anyway, stay greasy. This is your FPV Santa Claus checking out episode one, 2023 bacon season of giving. Until next time. Stay greasy. I'll catch you later. And share the FPV love. It's real important.